go ahead and get your journals out and write today's date in the top right corner. 1-25, oh, actually it's the 26. 1-26-21. Okay, so we are going to split up our paper into four sections, okay? Because we're going to represent a number together. So all you need to do, you can draw a line down like this, and then a line across like this. All right, so I'm going to say a number. We are going to write the expanded, or sorry, the standard form of the number. Then we are going to write or draw the picture form. We're going to expand it, and we're going to write the word form, okay? So the number that we're going to be working with is 109. 109. Let's write it in standard form. 1 for 100. Zero in the one or in the tens place, nine in the ones place. If we had just written it as one hundred nine, that's the number nineteen. That's not the one hundred. That's not the number one hundred nine. We need to have that zero in there. Okay, one hundred nine. Well, let's draw a picture of the number one hundred nine. We have a one in our hundreds place. So we need to draw a square. So right here, go ahead and draw a square to represent our 100 in our tens place. Do we need to draw any tens? No, there's zero. Let's look at our ones place. How many ones do we need? Nine. Great job. So let's draw nine ones. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. All right, now let's work on our expanded form, okay? So let's look at each um, digit first. Let's look at our hundreds first. One in our hundreds place. What is the value of that one? 100, great job. So down here, let's write 100. Well, now let's add our next value. How many tens? Zero. So let's write the zero right there. And then let's put a plus sign, and now let's add our ones. How many ones? nine ones. Great job. So that's 109. Sometimes you might see it as 100 plus zero plus nine. And some people, um, if you they write it, they'll actually leave out that zero. So this, they'll just write 100 plus nine. Either way, those are expanded forms of 109. And then the last thing is word form. Okay, so let me pull up my word wall. Hmm, see if you can put your finger on the number 100. This is the number 100, so this is the word form of 100. Let's write that down in our journals. 1, O-N-E, 1, 100. I'll give you a few seconds. 100. And then we need 9. Well, we can use our word wall for 9. Here's the number 9. 9. So let's write that down in our journals. We also notice it has that magic or silent E at the end. N I N E. 109. All right, if you need some more time to copy this down, I'll leave it up. Otherwise, for your activity today, you are going to be working with different forms of numbers to 120 um, on Education Galaxy today.